this video is on uniform distribution in today's video the problem is if x is uniform random variable in minus 1 and 1 find the probability density function mean and the variance of x see here what is given x is uniform random variable so x is given as it's a uniform random variable It's a uniform random variable in minus 1, comma 1. Here A is equal to minus 1 and B is equal to 1. And therefore, the probability density function is given as, is given as, see here, f of x is equal to 1 by B minus A, where x lies between A and B and 0 otherwise. See here, 0 otherwise. Therefore, our f of x value is equal to 1 by b minus a. So, b is equal to 1 minus of minus plus 1. This is minus 1 less than x less than plus 1 and 0 otherwise. See here, our f of x value is equal to 1 by 2. Minus 1 less than x less than 1 and 0. This is otherwise. So, this is nothing but the probability density function. Therefore, First one, the probability density function is given by, so for our question, here it is half, this is half, x lies between minus 1 and 1 and 0 otherwise. And the next thing, what it is asked, so we have to find out the mean. For finding the mean, I made a video here, so here the mean value is equal to a plus b by 2. So, mean of uniform distribution is nothing but the formula is a plus b by 2. Here, the interval is minus 1 and 1. So, if I take a as minus 1 and b as plus 1. So, this will be minus 1 plus 1 by 2. So, this value is equal to 0. So, I got the mean value as 0. And the next one is variance. So, for finding the variance also, I made a video for this formula. So, this is variance of uh, the uniform distribution is nothing but B minus A whole square by 12. So, here minus 1 and uh, plus 1. So, this is A and this is B. So, the variance of X is nothing but what is the B value? 1 and A value is minus 1 minus of minus plus 1 by 2. So, which is equal to 2 square by 12. So, which is equal to 4 by 12. And therefore, the value here is 1 by 3. So, if I cancel in 3 table, so this will be 1 by 3. Therefore, we got the variance of uniform distribution as 1 by 3 and mean as 0. So, the mean of x is equal to 0. And the next thing is the probability density function we, get, we got as 1 by 2 minus 1 less than x less than 1 and 0 otherwise. So, this is how we have to solve. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, in my next video, I will be uploading about hypergeometrical distribution. Have a look at those uh, videos. And definitely, it will be very helpful. And pass it on to your friends and practice well. Thank you so much.